Hey Turf fans, it's Mr. Smiley here with part one of our 50 vs. 50 war recap with the ironically named Lucky. And we had a huge, uh, huge town hall and hero advantage against them. Uh, rather than, than just, you know, I, I do want to show these attacks. They're against, uh, I have a couple of them, uh, one against town hall 11, a two star. And uh, Scuba and I each had a three star against town hall 10s. Um, both using, uh, or all of them using the Valkasm combo, and uh, Terpso 1 and Gat both came really close to getting a 3-star on another base with the same combo. So I just want to highlight how the, you know, this combo that we've been using for raids, for war, is pretty versatile and can, uh, can work against a lot of bases, that once you get the funneling down, it really, you know, that that's the trick that uh, it just becomes about the funneling, and uh, the queen walk on the outside, and to kind of steer them into the core, plus the the giant Valk wizard core dive uh, can gut a ton of bases. So here we have a town hall eleven, and even though we've we've heard now today that the eagle is getting buffed in terms of town hall ten versus town hall eleven, the eagle is no joke. Um, so really, the you know the first step with a lot of these attacks, your choice is either to do a queen walk to get rid of that eagle before you start dropping 150 troops, including spells which cost five each. Uh, you either drop the queen walk to get rid of the eagle first before the core dive, or you just need a really fast like Lunian or Dragon attack to get rid of the town hall and just bum rush so that the eagle can't destroy you. Uh, so sorry about a little bit of lag here. Uh, I chose on this one. Uh, the, the town hall was in the, the center and the eagle was off-centered, so I decided to do a queen walk. There's a ton of damage coming there from the two expos and some cannons, uh, so I had to drop the rage there. Uh, eagle's going to come up, and that golem is just basically a distract for the eagle. It helps funnel a little bit. But the primary attack is going to be the core dive there. So even after the update, we should be able to use a golem as a distract, but it's going to get rid of that. The eagle is just, just going to destroy it that much more quickly. Uh, so here the the hound shattered, and uh, but the you know the queen does her job and gets the eagle down. She manages to survive, although a couple of healers start getting picked off by the expo. Core dive comes in. You know, because I had to use the rage for the queen, I went with three rages and a freeze and had to drop the heal. Um, but I still wanted the two rages to get the, the giants and the Valk into that core quickly and, and the wizards to, to core out that base. So here's just a, you know, I know a two star isn't super impressive, but uh, I mean, Town Hall 11s, you know, you see on the, on Reddit and the forums and stuff, people complaining that the eagle was, was worthless. And those people are not Town Hall 10s who are in War Clans, because the, the Eagle was no joke before, um, and now with the with the buff that, that uh, it's going to do three times the amount of damage against Golems. I mean, it shouldn't impact most of my my Town Hall 11 strategies, uh, but it's, you know, still no joke. You know, it, it's going to hurt a little bit. Um, so here, you know, just a little bit more percentage. Uh, Unfortunately for me, the uh, you know the air defense was was placed there that that uh, wasn't able to you know do a full walk around and get a three, but I was pretty damn happy with a 67% two star. Uh, anytime you can walk away with a two star on a on a non rush town hall ten, that's that's a win. So here, you know, now after going up against 11s, the the tens really don't seem so bad. This one is a wide open base. Um, the one thing that I do want to point out here is that I'll just do it while talking. So I don't need the the wall breakers while opening into that gigantic core. Um, but the, really, the key with the queen part is that you want to be able to take out an air defense. And where you see the air defense there, I can't get it just with a queen walk. Um, you know, so I had thought about bringing a couple wall breakers, but. Uh, you know, she. I decided I didn't really want her going in there too quickly, um, so I just uh, I just let her chew through the wall and get that air defense instead. But you're still going to drop her in front of the air defense, and there you see the the big mass of uh, spells go down in the core. The rage 
followed by a freeze, then a heal while the you know while the inferno is being frozen, then the other rage to get back you know the town hall and the back core, uh, the back inferno, and they're just gonna wipe through you know the Valkyrie's eyes are all light lighting up and uh, the base like this with such a huge wide open core uh, that you know they can just do a ton of damage. So I just demolish the core here on this base. So not not the toughest base. Uh, I guess maybe it's tricky against some that you know it's hard to path to the to the town hall. But when you have the big massive rage giants in Valkyrie, it's really not that big of a deal. And then at this point, you know the crossbow goes down, archer tower goes down. There's really you know I have a straight path to that last air defense. There's really nothing that's going to jeopardize uh, me getting the three star, except maybe you know if she if the queen would have to chew through one of those walls to get like a hut or a, or a barrack or something like that. But fortunately for, for me, she does not need to do that. So I'm just going to speed it up while we watch her and that one little archer uh, finish the job. All right. Again, showing the the versatility against these uh, these box bases at least. Uh, here's Scubo with a with a nice three star. Uh, this is our nemesis base that uh, you know we see a, a couple times each war, and uh, also pretty much half of our war raids now are against these nemesis bases. You know, once Mocha Boy and his Red of Force Chronicles channel showed us the the proper funneling technique for these bases. Now, instead of avoiding these bases, I think we all just, our eyes just light up. Everybody else seems to avoid them, so you find a lot of fat ones out there. And then we just can destroy them. Uh, I mean, it's just so easy once once you do it a couple of times. You just drop the queen. She's going to destroy some of those perimeter defenses that are so spread out that, uh, you know, they're not going to pose much risk to her might have to pop her ability once but then you're safe here scuba's not even going to go with the golem war comp he's just going to go with the regular raiding comp because the space is so weak um and oh i see he does have a golem there uh, but still a ton of ton of giants really heavy giant composition here uh it does a nice job of funneling him into that core the rage and the freeze and the heal to keep him give him a little bit more strength and it, it just cores out that base. And even if the, the freeze, you know, if you drop it on the on one of the Inferno and the other one is firing, when you have, you know, six to eight Valkyrie and you got whatever, 15 Giants that he has there, I mean, the, the one Inferno that's up is only going to fire on about five of them at once. Not about. It's only going to fire on five of them at once. And so you're still doing a lot of healing for the other. Uh, so, it's, you know, there is his Burger King and a bunch of wizards survived the core dive. And at this point, this raid is over. The only thing that could jeopardize it is if his uh, his queen somehow gets tangled around uh, in front of that air defense and the air defense can take out the healers. But, you know, there really isn't much risk with that, of that with these kinds of bases. So let's go ahead and let's let's speed this up a little bit. And just watch, uh, you know, watch the queen just dismantle the, the remains of this base. So, awesome job, Scuba. And uh, again, just showing how, you know, why this has become the, our, our clan's Town Hall 10 attack of, of choice. So, back with part two that's showing some of the...